we actually had uh, some success running the football against them, rushed for the ball, rushed for a little, little over 100 yards against them. But at this point, uh, you know, we think that we've got to figure out exactly where we're going with the quarterback spot. Hopefully, that we'll get Corey back. But um, we'd like to try to maybe blend the two together some and see how that works for us for a little bit until we get Corey back to full speed because he's going to be limited to a certain degree regardless. And uh, we'd like to try to get him back to 100% before we throw the whole, uh, whole horse back into the whole deal. But at the same time, we would like to continue to give Andre some reps. And uh, add to the mix that we think that Prometheus Franklin is going to be back. Um, this week to full speed. He's not. I don't know if you ever read a full speed at, within a year of having an ACL deal. But um, he looks like he might be getting close. And the doctors have released him to go ahead and play. So we'll, we'll start trying to work with him some too. Somehow or another. I don't know if we can figure out how to work with two, less more three. So. Um, it will be interesting to see exactly where we do go to uh, from here. We've got to find some offense. And against the big teams, against the good teams that we're playing now, uh, including Jackson. Um, but Charlotte defensively last week had a bunch of them big behemoths out there. They had all those transfers from Michigan and Alabama and all that kind of stuff. So they, you know, they have some, they have some bodies. And, uh, We've got to figure out exactly, you know, what we can do against those guys. But eventually, we're going to get back to our level of competition. Uh, this is our last week of this. Uh, we'll get a week off after that. Uh, it'll give us a chance to really, con I guess, maybe kind of reflect a little bit and evaluate a little bit and then decide where we're going to from here. But um, Georgia Tech looks good. Um, they were.